Hi everybody, Patrick here from EngineeringShot.com, ElectronicLessons.com, and PaintballProps.com. Today I'm going to show off uh, the semi-final version of the Mega Man arm gun circuitry. Uh, this speaker is driven by a uh, uh, internal amplifier on the audio chip, and uh, this is a one watt speaker. It's pretty loud. This is my uh, LED, a new and improved uh, LED PCB. Uh, it drives uh, red, green, and blue. Sorry, red, green, blue, and yellow LEDs. Uh, via a controller on the back that plugs through a cable to the main board which has a microchip, a button, the relative other circuitry and the audio chip and there's also a lot of customization options on the board that's why I say semi-final because I've got a fair bit left that I can do with this so I'm going to show you in the light and then I'm going to show you a couple times in the darkness what it does power it up, press the button So now I'm going to turn off the light and I'll show you in the darkness. That's just a shot of the LED board and... Let's do it again. I'm hoping that my camera can actually pick up how cool this looks. So the sequence starts with uh, blinking uh, certain LEDs, um, two sets, then four sets, then uh, all six sets. Uh, each controller controls two LEDs, so one controls these two, these two, then these two, these two, those two, and those two. So it starts off with the charge sequence of those lighting up, uh, blink, blink, two, blink, blink, four, blink, blink, six, and all, all of them are lit up. And then it goes into the, the charge sequence where Mega Man is holding the charge and all of the LEDs uh, pulse on and off through some pulse width modulation. And then finally, uh, all sets of LEDs turn on and off in order to finish off with one pulse width modulation that turns it off. So let's just show, let, let's go through the sequence. Power up. Charged. And as you saw, all the LEDs. Uh, flickered uh, clockwise and then it uh, pulsed with modulated off. So I think it's pretty cool. Let's just show it one more time. Again, not 100% sure that the camera can pick up how cool that looks. Uh, but regardless, I'm pretty happy with it. I'll probably tinker a bit before I put it up for sale. Uh, I imagine to have it up for sale by mid-January. 2014. So, thanks for watching, everyone. I sincerely appreciate it. I hope you all had a, a Merry Christmas or whatever you celebrate, and a Happy New Year. Take care.